Yeah, I'm sorry. It's unbelievable. I really needed you tonight. Hello, welcome back to another theory from Frasier Season 1. Finale proves Niles knows his brother well. Prepare for the ultimate farewell as Frasier bids adieu in its season finale. In this jaw-dropping episode, Niles Crane takes center stage, proving he knows his brother like no other. Join us as we unpack the emotional highs and hilarious moments that make this send-off unforgettable. Will it be a tearjerker or a laughter-filled goodbye? Tune in to find out and celebrate the end of an era with Frasier. Fans of Frasier expressed great concern over the lack of communication between Frasier Crane and his brother Niles. Those worries weren't satisfied as the Frasier reboot developed since Frasier didn't talk about his brother very often. Although Niles' son David has frequently discussed his parents, there have been a few indications that their relationship may not be entirely harmonious. Reindeer Games entirely allays those fears. Who else would Frasier turn to for solace when his dinner party goes south and everything looks to be crumbling apart but Niles? Fans can't hear Pierce say any lines, but it's obvious that the two get along well. Even yet, there's a hint of spicy brio hiding beneath the surface of the brotherly relationship. Niles sends a text message, which Frasier reads out loud. The passage reads, It was the eve of Christmas, and not a creature was stirring anywhere in the house. Apart from Frasier, who overindulged and spoiled the eggnog. That's the Crane brothers that we all know and love, and Niles appears in Reindeer Games more than once. Furthermore, he's not the only original character who appears in the episode. Niles isn't the only original Frasier character mentioned or present during the Reindeer Games. The episode has one additional reference to Niles. In the midst of the celebration, he also gives his brother a call in an attempt to speak with his son David. Frasier tells a falsehood and claims that everything is going fine during the one-sided talk. The foul honks, interrupting his boastful remarks about the freshness of his live-delivered goose. He then declares that the party clown he hired has come. The other original Frasier character to make an impression in Reindeer Games is Roz Doyle, who visits Boston to console Frasier. Niles is not the only one. She says that Alice, her daughter, is now an adult who has a romantic partner in a separate existence. During the talk, Niles' ex-wife Maris is also brought up. Both she and Roni, the second wife of Martin Crane, are still living. For those who are present in person and others who are only mentioned briefly, it all adds up to a joyous occasion. Thank you for watching.